And it's your boy, the number one ghetto. Ghetto bodybuilder, man. You know, swole than ever, man. I'm back dropping some more game, giving you more tips, man, how to get swole, how to get your weight up at the gym, man. Y'all know how I do coming with the motivational content on the daily. We finna get right to it. I'm finna give you the blueprint, the fastest way to gain muscle mass, man. This if you this is if you natural, you know, you're trying to stay natural. Me, I'm lifetime natural, man. I know a lot of people make a big fuss about that these days. Back when I was coming up, man, in high school, college, man, we did working out. We worked out for sports. I played football. I'm a former college athlete. So I we ain't really I didn't talk about or you know, steroids and drugs and all that. All I ever took was protein, creatine, pre-workout. I still, that's the same thing I take to this day. You know, the pre-workout, that's all I take, man. All this stuff you can get at Walmart. I don't know really about the hardcore drugs or, you know, the, the steroids and all that, man. We was doing this for sports, man. We just like to work out for fun, you know, and the love of it, you know. So that's what we trying to keep it going. But if you're trying to put on masks, as fast as possible, the way you gotta do it, man, is you gotta you gotta hang near a four speed yourself. You gotta start eating more. That's the first thing. A lot of people they come to me at the gym. They like, yo, how can I put on muscle mass fat, or how can I get swole? Like, you know what I mean? I'm like, yo, you probably ain't eating enough, man. If you've been working out on a consistent basis, man, and you ain't seeing no gains, man. The first thing I tell people, man, you probably ain't eating enough. You gotta start eating more. You know, I constantly give this comparison. It's kind of like with your body, you're going from a Honda to a Corvette or a Mustang. So a Honda got a smaller engine. It takes 87 for the gas. The Corvette or the Mustang probably take 89 or 93, depending on the model. So you got to look at it in that, in that sense, whereas you're going from a smaller engine to a bigger engine. So when your body your body's getting bigger, you putting on more muscle mass, you need more fuel. The fuel is the food, you know? So you gotta eat, man. You know, I tell the youngsters in high school, they be coming up asking me, you're DMing me, man, how can I get like you, man? You know, I'm like 150, 160. I'm trying to put on some weight. I'm like, man, just eat, eat, man. You gotta eat like Sherman Clump, man. Eat, you go. Don't worry about uh, doing cardio, trying to eat cleaner, eat heavy foods like pasta, spaghetti, you know what I mean? Uh, out of steak, if you are hamburgers, if you can't afford steak right now, you know what I mean? The stuff like that. Eat, just eat everything inside. Even when you ain't hungry, you need to be eating, man. You need to be eating around the hour. Dang, it's dang near like you got to force feed yourself, you know? And I had some people come up to me and they was like, they'd rather do like a clean bulk or whatever. I don't know what that meant by that. I'm like, when you look at the breakdown, what not a food, when you're doing a clean bulk, a lot of the food, they don't have like a lot of calories in them. You know, when you when you cutting down, you got to figure out if you want, if you cut it or you bulk and that's two different things. The purpose of this video is for people that's bulk and trying to add muscle mass, trying to add size into their frame. You got to eat calorie dense food and you gotta eat a lot of it, man, you know? And don't worry about thinking you're gonna get fat. A lot of times, I see a lot of people, man, they already skinny, so that tells me, and a lot of them be in high school that be coming to me asking me these questions, that tells me they probably already got a fast metabolism, so none really sticking to them, you know? A lot of kids in high, they probably like me, they play sports, you know, on the run constantly, man, so you, you ain't gonna get fat, you know? You got a dang near, be sitting on the couch every day and acting like a couch potato stuff in your face like that thing, like it's no tomorrow in order for you to get fat. If you working out, you gonna burn through them calories. You gonna need the extra calories anyways. So then once you start eating, 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 you, you gotta hit the gym, of course. That's the second key. Everybody know that, but they think the gym comes before nutrition. Nah, it's the other way around. You gotta eat big, man. It's a it's an analogy I like that everybody like to use, man. I'm pretty sure y'all probably heard it. It's eat big and lift big to get big. You know, you can't have one without the other. You gotta have them, they go hand in hand. So you you gotta dang near force feed yourself, man. You know, I I'll tell people, man, especially like high school kids, man, if this were a few months, don't do no cardio, just lift weights. And just eat whatever you can, whatever you can get your hands on, man. I'm talking pizza, 
burgers, man. If your mom and pops, you still live with your parents, man. Whatever they cooking, man. Pile on your plate, man. They making meat, loaf, mashed potatoes or something. A great man. Have you two plates, man. Pile it on, man. You got to pile it on. You know, that's how you get big. You know, get that size on and you hit that gym, man. You just going to swell up. You just going to keep adding weight. You know, me, I, I, I cut down and uh, like two years ago, I weighed 205 pounds. I'm currently like 240 pounds. This over a two year period. I was just kind of just been eating here lately and bulking, man, kind of eating whatever and working out. I ain't really worried about the cutting part. You know, when you get, as you uh, start getting more bulk on, if you natural, you're going to lose your abs a little bit, you know, but if you bulking up, you put the size on, then you can worry about the cutting down part later and getting the definition and all that. But you still going to have definition if you're working out, but it just ain't going to be as cut, you know. But that's you got. That's why I go back to saying you got to identify your goals, what you're trying to do. you either cutting or you're bulking. You can't do both. It's kind of hard, you know. So when you're bulking up, you're trying to get swole, put that size on, man. You see, I'm, man, this is a 20-year commitment, man. I'm still at it, man, chugging away, man. You know, I'm like I said, I'm eating, man. I'm constantly eating, man. Loading my plate up, man. You then go to the buffet, kill the buffet after the gym, man. You know, or hit the buffet first, then hit the gym later, man. But you gotta eat that food, man. Even when you probably think you eating enough, you probably ain't. You know, you, that's why I say carry some food on you. You got a book bag. You at school carry extra food on you, bananas or peanut butter, man. Protein shake. You gotta have more calories, man, because you you trying to you drive. It's like I said, you dropping a bigger engine into the Mustang. You going from the Honda to the Mustang, so you dropping it in there, and then it's gonna blow. It's gonna blow you up, man, over time, man. You know, y'all like this video? Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like, share, uh, tweet it, whatever, man. Let people know what's up, man. I'm putting people on the game. You gotta eat. That's the key. Eat big, man. You gotta eat big. Imagine like you eating big like Sherman Clump, man. That's how you're going to blow up, man. And hit that iron. Hit that steel, man. Like I always say, I got merchandise for sale, man. Check me out. www.thegettobodybuilder.com. I got merchandise for sale, man. A lot of catchy quotes, man. On hoodies, t-shirts, man. Just something to get people fired up for the gym, man. So, yeah. Load your plate up, man. Then hit that gym, man. That's what it boils down to. We eating, man. Eating everything in sight, man. You ain't gonna get fat as long as you're working out, doing what you're supposed to do. It ain't like you're doing this forever, neither. You know, some people think they're doing this forever. This is for like a six month to a year period where you kind of, where you kind of just, you just eating whatever, man. Whatever you can find, man. Whatever I'm talking about, just eat, eat, and eat some more, man. You know, eat like a horse. You know, you gotta eat like you like it's your last meal, man. Pile your plate up, man. And you're going to put that size on, I'm telling you, man. I, I know what I'm talking about, man. I know my stuff. So, yeah, y'all stay with it, man. Keep grinding. Keep hustling, man. Stay focused out here, man. We're going to all get swole. Y'all know how we coming. Let's get motivated.